Authority, meteorologist Ron Rhodes. We are looking at the Twin Bridges right now on this Friday. We're about to head into the afternoon. We got ourselves a good looking start to the day. Now it's going to start to get a little hot out there, but the good news is it's not going to be humid. Not today. Humidity starts to creep back up tomorrow, though. As so we take a look at the traffic, and there's plenty of it there. That's our Diamond Valley Federal Credit Union camera there at Deaconess Gateway, looking at 66 and 69. Busy interchange, and I guess a lot of folks are heading out there to get some grub on the east side of town. Good for you if you're doing it doing just that. Uh, and now let's take a look at a couple other tower cam stops. Ah, uh, yes. And uh, we're looking at the roof claim camera on top of the Hampton. Look at that. It looks like some smoke over there in the distance. And, you know, we're looking to the east right now in Owensboro. I wonder if there's like, <laughs> I hope that's not like something. You know, Yellow Creek Park is just east of Owensboro. And that's where Romp is going on. So maybe it's, maybe it's a really impressive pyrotechnic show. I don't know. Uh, but that doesn't look too encouraging. There's the Ohio River, and that, of course, is from the Hampton Inn in downtown Owensboro. There's the bend in the river, and we've got ourselves a look at the Superior Ag camera on top of Fifth Third Bank. Right now, the temperature, 87 degrees. Now, we've got a dew point of 52. 52, and it is late June. This is living right right here. Love to see that, even though it's high heat, but that's the reason why the temperature's surging so fast. We started down around 60 this morning, uh, but with that drier air, temperatures rising faster. They're gonna fall pretty quickly too this evening, so it should be a very pleasant evening. East wind at around eight miles an hour. But yeah, we're heating up across the board. 88 degrees Tell City, 86 degrees in Madisonville, 85 Henderson, 87 degrees in Princeton. But look at the dew points. Most all of us, we see the teal here, not the green. We're talking about temp dew points that are in the 50s. 58 Henderson, 59 in Owensboro, 56 in Jasper, 58 Princeton, 55 Karma, 58 down to the south in Madisonville and Dixon. So, yeah, I got a few 60s on the board, but where we are seeing 60s, mainly right at 60 degrees, and that's borderline pleasant and tolerable right there. So, looking good. Heat index basically is what we've got. What you see on the thermometer is what you're going to feel in outside. Beautiful sunset last night. This is from Mary Corps of Posey County, and Mary got the goods on that shot there. And of course, her husband, Warren, works here at the station. He's our assignment editor. Mary, though, great shot, love it. And then Owensboro, this is another good looking shot. We've got <laughs> great shots from all across the tri-state. This is from Lisa Black in Owensboro. She saw, she saw that setting sun and that spectacular sky, and she took a great shot there. And I love how the trees kind of like are bordering it or framing the sides. Lovely shot there, Lisa. Thank you so much. You get some good ones there. And look at this from Richland. Scott Goins got this beautiful sky. A little bit later, you know, it's kind of a little darker, a little moodier right there as a few clouds came in. Just some high clouds, though, not bringing us any rain. We could use the rain, though. We're running a rainfall deficit of better than two and a half inches for the month of June alone. And we now have a bit of a drought, a moderate drought. It's considered southern Posey, southern Vandenberg County, although we had some pretty good rains down in western Kentucky, still unusually dry for this time of the year, and farther to the north, still unusually dry as well. Storm Tracker is showing a lot of rain in northern Missouri, but that will not be making its way our way. We are getting some clouds, though, that are spilling off of these thunderstorms to the west, and they have been pretty impressive in the past 24 hours. They had some reports of tornadoes, too, in Kansas, but not a threat right now in Missouri. The rougher weather is going to be farther to the north, it looks like, in the code is later on today, but pretty quiet map outside of northern Missouri. For us here in the tri-state, though, a few extra clouds, and I'm telling you what, uh, the sun is setting at a quarter after eight or right around there, central time, and about 15 minutes after, really 10, 15 minutes after, that's when you'll probably get your best color. So I think right around 8.30, we're going to have some broken clouds out there. You see that? That could make for a really good-looking sunset again after last night's spectacular, dynamic uh, sunset that we had there. First thing tomorrow morning, you can see we've got a few clouds in play. We're going to see some sunshine. If you're traveling down around Bowling Green off to Louisville, you might run across a stray shower. Looks dry for us here in the tri-state, though. Here we go, though, as we head into Sunday. Now we're starting to notice a few showers and thunderstorms up to the north, and we are going to see up to the northwest these thunderstorms kind of work their way in first thing in the morning, right around daybreak, and then we're going to get a break in the middle of the day, only to have the cool front move through late in the afternoon. I think a few more showers and thunder showers later in the day on Sunday. And that's two rounds that we could have, and we could use the rain, no doubt about that, but that's it. I mean, that's the only chances for rain we've got both on Sunday. 90 degrees for a high today with a mix of sun and clouds. Not that humid out there, though, with that high of 90 degrees. And we got a northeast wind around 5 to 10. On the three-degree guarantee, I called for a high yesterday of 89, got up to 91. That's a three-degree guarantee winner. Stephen Williams of Poseyville, congratulations, Stephen. You got yourself an umbrella courtesy of Ackerman Chiropractic on the seven-day forecast. Temperatures 90 today. Again, not that humid. It is going to be a little on the humid side on Saturday, 94 degrees. 
Sunday, yeah, not looking good as far as the humidity goes, but we are going to see some rain, which we could use right now. And that's our only chance for rain we've got. One in the morning, actually one in the afternoon with that cool front. And look at the temperature drop on the back of that front. And it's going to be less humid, too, on Monday and Tuesday. High of only 81. The average high is 88. Love it. 60 on Tuesday morning, 61 on Wednesday morning. Angie needs to be power walking like five miles both Tuesday and Wednesday morning. I think you should do. be. Look, Look at that. Stunning sunset last night. We've already shown a couple from Indiana. I've shown one from Kentucky. Here's one from Illinois, from Allendale. And this is Deanna Brown, who got that spectacular sky gorgeous. last night. Gorgeous, Unbelievable. gorgeous. Unbelievable. We'll be back with more lifestyles right after this.